Okay, what is Russell Westbrook doing? Why is he allowing Devin Booker this angle? Why doesn't he turn his body this way and force him here where you, Eric Gordon's just waiting to help you? Like, okay, so Devin Booker says, I'll take this then. If you're a Vika Zubak, you've got to stay connected to your man. Look at Zubak right here. So he thinks Aiton is setting a screen this way, so he's going to set up and drop coverage this way. Whoops, well, Aiton's setting the screen this way, and you're nowhere to be found. Okay, so there's a loose ball right here. If you're Marcus Morris, you got to at least start to get back a little bit here because if you just wait to see who comes up with this loose ball and it's Phoenix, whoops, now it's a three-on-two. Okay, if Avika Zubak is going to come trapped, there's got to be movement along this back line right here, okay? Eric Gordon's got to get up. You're not worried about a player two passes away if it's a good enough trap, but you got to take the roll because once this pass to the roll gets made, Josh Okogie right here, well, now Aiton's one pass away. Terrible footwork here on the drop coverage by Zubak. You see your man setting a screen, so you got to get your feet set, okay? You've got to be able to guard the ball, but you have to be able to recover onto Aiton. Look at Zubak here. Like he's, You have no chance of recovering onto Aiton again. Okay, if the Clippers are trapping again, then Batum has to go over the screen. Like, what is Batum doing? This is not a trap. Where are you, Batum? Norman Powell goes up for this shot right here. Marcus Morris cannot just stare at the shot. You've got to get back. If everybody just stares at the shot, transition defense, I mean, here we go. You have got to be kidding me with Batum here. Please sprint back and get your feet set. You're going to backpedal on Kevin Durant, maybe the greatest scorer of all time. That is just sad. Okay, you cannot switch here. If you're Terrence Mann, you got to stay with Aiton. Battle for position with Aiton. Plumlee's got to stay here with Durant. I mean, you're trying to switch here, so now look what happens. Aiton's just hanging out in the charge circle, and he's got Plumlee sealed. You have to do something about this first ball screen right here. Bones Highland probably should just switch, okay? The Clippers do nothing here. So this now Aiton doesn't even have to set a screen. He can just start rolling, and that totally screws up your drop coverage on the second screen. Okay, what is Norman Powell doing here? Devin Booker picks his dribble up. His dribble is picked up. All Norman Powell has to do is just stay in front of Devin Booker with his hands up. Where is Norman Powell going? What are you, where were you going there? You just gave Devin Booker room when he had none. Okay, Russell Westbrook is guarding Kevin Durant. Could you please see the ball and Kevin Durant? I mean, look at Russell Westbrook just staring at the ball, staring at the ball. So Durant catches this, you're not ready to guard. That is really pathetic. Okay, here's Norman Powell just staring at the ball. I mean, could you please see your man as well? Ball you man is like something you learn in like kindergarten. What is Norman Powell doing? Okay, what is Norman Powell doing again? You have to take Devin Booker. Marcus Morris is taking Chris Paul. I suppose he should have communicated this, but we have two people guarding Chris Paul and no one going to Devin Booker. Problem. Okay, so Russell Westbrook is staring at the ball again. Fine, and not seeing his man. Well, okay, so now you're seeing your man, Devin Booker right here. He gets an offensive rebound. Uh, why are you not staying with Devin Booker here? Like, what? I'm sorry. This is an elimination game. Why can't Norman Powell just keep his feet set? Where is he going here? Why is he backpedaling? So you just backpedaled into a screen that you have, could have easily gotten over if you just kept your feet set. So now you got to go up the gut of this down screen, and you have zero chance of guarding this handoff now. What is the Clippers' thing with backpedaling? If you're Eric Gordon, you got to sprint back and get your feet set. If you're playing off of your back foot while Devin Booker has a full head of steam downhill, uh, good night. This is just unbelievable. This is like out of a movie. Uh, please sprint back and get your feet set. Backpedaling on Kevin Durant is not a great idea. I, what else is there to say? How many times does this need to happen before the Clippers do something? Could one of these Clippers players staring at the shot, just one, just start sprinting back at the shot. Like, everybody just stares. So guess what? Here's Devin Booker with the easiest two points of his life. Okay, so Eric Gordon is trying to set up the drop coverage. He wants Kevin Durant. He wants the drop coverage right here. So you got to get up here. Like, look at Eric Gordon right here. Okay, get up. You cannot get screened like this. 
Now you're off balance. And with Kevin Durant, it's an and one after the refs talk about it for a second. Why is Russell Westbrook looking for a screen right here? Just guard the ball. See, you're looking for a screen. Why are you switching the screen? You have about a mile to get over this screen. So you end up calling for a switch at the 11th hour. Norman Powell isn't ready to switch, so he's going to stay stuck on this screen, and Devin Booker's wide open. Stop backpedaling. Sprint back. Get your feet set. It is literally offensive to think that you can backpedal on Devin Booker in transition. It's offensive. Okay, what is Norman Powell doing for about the 400th time? He's just staring at the ball. How about you see the ball and your man, Devin Booker? So Devin Booker catches this. You're not ready to guard him even sort of. And Mason Plumlee isn't even sort of ready to switch here. I mean, how... What a joke. Okay, if you're trapping Devin Booker here, Mason Plumlee needs to get up. Up. This is how you trap. That. This is not trapping. This is just a couple of guys standing in the general vicinity of Devin Booker. So now this skip pass is way too easy. Oh, there's Durant. Beautiful. Get Norman Powell out of this game. Why is he not in a defensive stance with his feet set? He's got time. So instead of doing that, Norman Powell does what? Comes up here and gives Devin Booker this angle. That is, th this is like out of a movie. You just cannot crowd Devin Booker. You got to get in a defensive stance with your feet set. If you look at if you're you're gambling and crowding him, you think you're going to be able to slide your feet now. The answer is capital N, capital O. Terrence Mann is conceding this switch too soon. Look at Terrence Mann right here. Look when he concedes the switch. He just conceded the switch. Kevin Durant has even come off the screen. So Nicholas Batum isn't going to be ready to guard because Kevin Durant is still on this side of the screen. So. Yeah, crowd him at half court. That'll do something. Just get back. Why is Terrence Mann gambling as opposed to getting back? This is just complete trash. The Clippers are doing their stupid trap thing. There's got to be a rotation. So when Plumlee comes here, Terrence Mann has to come here. Because if a skip pass gets made here, Batum would rotate here. Uh, Norman Powell would go here, and Russell Westbrook would go here. That is, of course, all in theory, though. It's just comical that the Clippers constantly trap and have no idea what to do after it. So Norman Powell's going to come up here. Batum has to go to the corner. Terrence Mann would go here, and Russell Westbrook would go here. The Clippers are going to have Mason Plumlee now try and guard in the corner. Really? Really? This team deserves to be ousted from the playoffs yesterday. What do the Clippers do in practice? This is off of an inbounds. So why do we have two Clippers players guarding Josh Okogie and no one guarding DeAndre Ayton here? I mean, why? Like, come on. You think you're going to be able to crowd Devin Booker and gamble at half court and be able to slide your feet? Like, you think Devin Booker isn't going to cook you like this? Come on. It's a two-point game with a minute left. There's a loose ball. If you're Terrence Mann, you cannot just watch and wait and see what happens. You got to start to get back. Look at Terrence Mann. Stand oh, so the Suns have it, and you just stood still. So, pfft, nice. Go home.